First time you see it on the radar, could possibly be a false track, but then when you start to get multiple sensors reading the exact same thing, and then you get to see the display, that solidifies it. Again and again, the pilots were capturing bizarre-shaped objects on their F-18's cameras. Really no distinct wings, no distinct tail, no distinct exhaust plume, much like you see in the gimbal video. It seemed like they were aware of our presence because they would actively move around us. Both of us, both airplanes, see a disturbance in the water and a white 40-foot long tic-tac shaped object just hovering above the water, going forward, back, left, right. There's no rotor wash, there's no wings, nothing. And as I get within about a half mile of it, it rapidly accelerates to the south in about two seconds and disappears. This was extremely abrupt, like a ping pong ball bouncing off a wall. The ability to hover over the water and then start a vertical climb from basically zero up towards about 12,000 feet and then accelerate in less than two seconds and disappear is something I had never seen in my life. I believe, as do the other folks that were on the flight that we, when we visually saw it, that it was something not from this world. It was so unnerving because it was so unpredictable. High G, rapid velocity, rapid acceleration. So you're wondering, you know, how can I possibly fight this? When I say it was following us, I don't mean individual aircraft. I mean, wherever we were, they were there. So that could mean two things. That could mean they were already there or they were following the strike group, but they weren't following individual aircraft. Um, and of course, at this point, we're, we're like, okay, well, Clearly, this is nothing that we're used to seeing out there. We submitted a safety report saying that there was an unidentified object in our working space, and we don't know what to do.